Welcome back to episode three. Episode three of Musician Plays Minecraft Skyblock Evolution. Let's do it. Here comes the beat. Hey, guess what? I don't have to be scared anymore. I don't have to be scared anymore. Look what's behind here. Oh, no. This is a thing. God, the buttons are failing me. Oh, my goodness. Oh, but I've got a bed. Oh, my goodness. Oh. How good does that feel as the sun sets? Oh, we can take a load off. This is fabulous. I don't have to be afraid of the night anymore, which is kind of ironic because then I just sleep through it, of course. Oh, isn't that, a, isn't that amazing? Hey, everyone, I've got to say a massive thank you to the few people that have got in touch and said they've enjoyed the first couple of episodes of this series this is a new thing for me. I've never done this before, and uh, I'm loving the feedback. Uh, if you love it, let me know. If you don't like it, eh, let me know as well, and I can make it better. Uh, I love the feedback. Uh, you know, there's, there's heaps I've got to learn, so uh, thank you so much. Now, another question I've had before we get going. Uh, these little icons here. I'm rocking just a couple of tweaks from vanillatweaks.net, and I'll chuck a link in the description to these. Uh, they're just a couple of quality of life improvements. You may have noticed uh, in the last episode, the eagle-eyed among you, that my slimes are purple, and uh, eh, purple's my favorite color. And I noticed on Vanilla Tweaks you could change the color of your slimes. Look, why not? This one here, uh, this icon is telling me that these crops are fully grown. Um, Eh, a little bit cheaty, maybe, uh, maybe, but in the early game when everything's manual, uh, just to know that I've got crops uh, at full growth, it's just one of those things. It's, it's helpful to know. Uh, the dark UI is another thing you can do. I've got, uh, what do they call it, less obtrusive rain or something, so that when it rains, it's not as noisy. Pistons are a bit quieter. You know, there's just a few things you can do. So go and check that out, uh, and I'll put a link down under there. Uh, the mob farm. Holy heck. Let me talk, talk about these in a second. This thing is working like a charm. Uh, everything that falls down here is, except for, except for things that are, are wearing armor, of course, a one punchable, which is great. Check out the levels. I've got 60 levels. And these are all of the drops I'm getting. I'm getting flesh, bones, string, gunpowder, gravel. Uh, we get the odd witch... Odd witch? They're not odd. Uh, we get the occasional witch that drops, and uh, you get things like glass bottles and, ooh, ooh, redstone. I am looking forward to the redstone. Hello, I've done it again. No, there it is. Uh, bows. Uh, these will be great once we can combine a few of these, uh, get some of the enchantments, and get ourselves a nice, nice bow without much effort. Arrows, obviously, and armor. Uh, what did I just pick up then? Uh, just a bit of gunpowder. So, as you can see, I'm already getting, like, this is... Oh, mate. We're, we're, once we get, um... Once we get uh, out there somewhere is a little bit of... There it is. I can see it. At sugar cane. Uh, and we eventually get out into the end and get ourselves an elytra. We are going to have rockets for days. <sighs> so, uh, and look, the other thing... <laughs> Uh, no, no, there's more than one thing. Grass. The grass is down here. Uh, in a minute, we're going to run this out here and start getting some passive mobs, which would be great. Uh, there's a little thing with Skyblock feeling a little bit claustrophobic. You know, you start up the top there. Everything's kind of closed in, unlike regular Minecraft, where you've got a, a huge space you can go off and explore. Things start to feel a little bit cramped. Uh, ee! Bitty living space, as uh, the genie would say. Uh, so I've just moved our cobble generator uh, off to the side because I'm not going to need that. But I tell you what, I've got busy on that as well. And we're going to need that cobble to get ourselves out to these islands. And I reckon we start this episode by getting out there and collecting all the goodies we need to get ourselves a nether portal. Let's do it.
was intense and uh, a little bit hair raising. I, I look, I don't feel like I got close to falling off at any point, but oh, my hands are sore from the shifting and the running and the and the everything. <laughs> so, and, and look, you would have seen every chance I got, I was running back and making sure I was depositing all of the obsidian I was picking up into the chest as I went. Now, there's a reason I've picked this spot uh, to finish on. If I try to move any of this sand, it's going to fall, right? And uh, I'd like to keep the sand and uh, and what's attached to it. So ooh, we're going to try something here that uh, I'm not really sure about, to be honest. Uh, anything could happen here. The plan is that I'm going to drop some water over the edge. <clears throat> I'm going to jump in that water column and I'm going to drop us down a little bit underneath here so i really don't know look the great thing is if i lose the bucket we're already getting iron right that's the th that's that's the one consolation i've got here uh is that we can at least huh, okay we can at least recover if we need to so let's uh let's just see what happens if we go off uh into this little water stream here Oop. no 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 space up uh, uh, okay let's get how far down do we need to go i don't want to drown i don't want to drown okay uh, we want bottom slabs as well don't we so let's just make sure we've got what are we up to that's a bottom slab that's definitely low enough uh okay if we do this oh okay I think. Oh, you beauty! Well, that was a nice little uh, unexpected bit of excitement. Nice to get that. All right. Um, let's just get rid of this. Although, I guess wider rather than narrow is probably not a bad idea. Uh, I think I'm just going to build this up so that we've got uh, we've got ourselves way to get out of here good right okay that's uh this this is good this is good this is good this is good we want to get ourselves uh the platform uh now so the other thing you would have seen is that i've been building quite a large platform around uh each of the islands when we go back out there i uh, oh, probably don't have to come out this far <laughs> I'm getting a little bit carried away. Oh, I nearly missed that island there, the mushroom island. That uh, <laughs> I was I had my back turned to it, and I started just to go a little bit past it, which was going to be actually maybe we do want to come out here. Um, so yeah, so when we start collecting the trees and the saplings, I just want to make sure that we've got uh, plenty of room around those trees to uh, to catch anything that drops when we do go back out there again. Um, maybe one more, just for good luck. Here we go. Let's put this out here. Yep, very good. And uh, and I think we'll be back out here. So this is, this biome here is the desert biome. You can see there just over on the bottom left. Uh, so later on, when we want to get husks and start getting, uh, getting sand drops, uh, we're going to have to come back out here and build a mob farm. Uh, so that'll be something to look forward to in another episode. Oh no! Top slabs. Great. <clears throat> yeah, let's just uh, forget we saw that. Hey, this could have been a problem. I'm glad uh, glad it's the middle of the day because that could have been a nightmare. Um, we haven't yet had any random spawns. In fact, I've been quite amazed that um, now, of course, I'm going to want to just do this because otherwise my brain's going to scream at me. <sighs> it's the first time I've been happy to double place the slabs, really, to be honest. Like that first episode where every time I clicked, I was putting down the double slab. Here, I'll get rid of that bit. Here we go. Um, 
All right. There's one. Okay. I think I think we're good. I think are we good? Uh, I break one of these. Yep, great. And they're going to break, of course, because they're falling on, falling on the double slabs. <laughs> Come on. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> that was unique. Let's try that again. Look at this. Huh. All right. And of course, we're going to get the cactus. Whew. All right, so that's that one taken care of. Now, yeah, so we'll have to come back out here again when we want to uh, spawn husks, which um, will drop sand for us to make glass. <sighs> Who's ready to come on and come on a bit of a jog? Please tell me these are all uh, bottom slabs. That's all bottom slabs. These are bottom slabs. Are they, or have I got that wrong? They're bottom slabs as well. Whew, apparently I took a screenshot. That's nice. Okay, let's head on back out here. And, uh, and do this. Uh, now, we have got everything we now need to make ourselves our end portal, <sighs> which has got me a little bit excited. Now, of course, we don't have flint and steel. Mind you, now that we're getting gravel drops, you know what? I thought we were going to have to make this portal using fire spread, but I've been quite clever. I'm actually quite happy that I've got this mob farm. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, quite happy that I've got this mob farm done so early because I actually think now that we've got gravel, we can get ourselves flint and steel. Let's just try and do that. That means we can actually pick a nice spot to put our uh, our portal as well. That isn't going to be near the lava source. Normally what you do, in fact, we'll get down the bottom and I'll show you what I was actually going to do before I had my little revelation. Uh, if we get back down here, Geronimo. Oh. Such a great feeling, that. Uh, let's just pop that in there. Look at this. Woo -hoo -hoo. Uh, let's just put all the other bits and pieces we want to keep safe in there. Um, so, yeah. So, what you would normally do uh, if you didn't have access to flint uh, is using the fire spreading from the lava block in here. Uh, you could put some wood blocks down uh, um, and put your portal over here and actually let the fire spread in to light your portal for you. We're not going to do that. I think we're just going to run straight over here, get ourselves some gravel, put a bit of this down. Actually, I'm going to run everywhere. I can start making food now. Uh, I've got a shovel somewhere. Shovel? Oh yeah, right here. Uh, so let's do this. Oh, we'll need iron as well. Look at this. And this is coming from the zombie drops, of course. Zombies in Skyblock drop gravel and occasionally iron. Yes! We've got flint. <clears throat> now, of course, flint and steel. Right. Oh, I thought I saw another one of them. Where are we going to do this? this portal? Um, I'm liking this central spot. Uh, now I also forgot to mention, check out the grass. We've got grass down here. In a moment, we're going to run the grass out, uh, over here. Hmm. Portal, portal. Where do I put the portal? Uh, you know what? I think it's central's good. Central is good. There's the tree farm. What are we going to use the portal for? Are we going to be moving anything in and out of it? Probably not for a very long time. Uh, it's kind of nice with the trees. You know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it here. We can run the grass past that out to this side. I say we do the portal in line with these chests here. I don't think these chests are going to last very long. But let's do it right here. Okay, here comes the excitement. Let me see if I can uh, put a block in the wrong spot, huh? Nope, so far so good. One, two, one, two. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this. <laughs> because I know I'm gonna get it wrong. Three, three. Uh, that there, that there. 
Is this right? One, two, three. That there. That there. Please tell me I've got this right. Oh, of course. I need to get uh, some slabs up on top there to stop it from being spawn all. <laughs> I'm going to do this before I forget. I just know that I'm going to forget something somewhere. And uh, and we're going to get the spawns drop. Ouch. Uh, here we go. Ready for this? Let's go through. <laughs> I don't want to spend too long in here yet. But... Um... Hmm. Right. Uh... Okay. Um... Alright. This is just mildly terrifying. Holy... Oh! Oh, oh, oh. Ah, peripheral vision for the win. Vision. Peripheral vi Look at... I don't like the look of that. Um... Yeah. We've got to go out there. Um, I'm not ready for that. <laughs> I am... I am so... So not ready to be out there. <laughs> no, I don't like this very much. Let's just, uh... Let's just secure this ever so slightly. And, uh... Oh my goodness, come back here on another... I can see you out there, all you nasties. <sighs> okay, this at least means next time we come back here, we're not going to go falling off into the dark depths below. Oh, e uh, no, no, no. Okay. All right, hang on, which way is it? Where? There it is. I'm going to put this here to remind us that we... Well, actually, I don't need to do that, do I? Because we'll be able to find it next time. <sighs> I see you out there, people. Let's just... I can... Yes, out there. I'm coming to get you. Later, because I'm scared. Oh, actually... Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And up there. Come on, come on, come on. Look at that. Um, was anyone screaming? Oh, was anyone... <laughs> was anyone going to tell me? Oh, that would have been a bit of fun. Let's... Oh, um, that's that's going to save us, I reckon. That, that could have been a disaster there. Nothing is spawnable. All right, next time, Gadget. Okay, all right, we need to put a bit more space out there. Now, another thing that I need to do, and we're just going to keep an eye out for it, is the next episode, I would love to make us an iron farm. Getting onto some iron, getting ourselves kitted out a bit, uh, you know. I love my suit and all, but uh, getting a bit of armor on would be great. Uh, although, mind you, we do get we do get a bit from the drops. Uh, what we need to do is to get ourselves some zombie villages which will fall in here uh, I need to keep my eye out while we're doing this today to um, watch for any that, that fall down here and we have to isolate them now doing that is a little bit nerve wracking uh, I'm pretty sure that will be my first death of the season oh man I saw that purple and thought that was the purple of the zombie for a second then. <laughs> I'm starting to get jumpy again. We saw what I was like the first couple of episodes with uh, with the phantoms, which thankfully we never saw any of because I'm a boss and I made this. <laughs> Still proud of this. Still proud of this. Um, so we're going to keep an eye out here for any zombie villagers uh, falling. But you know what? I think we need to reclaim our dirt and uh, get off in this direction and get ourselves some passive mob spawning. So, I'm watching you over there. The uh, the trick is to um, either... Uh, the, <laughs> the trick is to 
catch uh, the zombie villagers. So I clear it out regularly and uh, and catch them um, when they first spawn. Because once you get a few things in there, it, it becomes a bit of a, a bit of a nightmare to isolate them. But you know, I'm up for the challenge. Uh, where's my grass? It is here. Yes. All right. Well, this is pretty simple. What I've got to make sure I don't do <clears throat> is uh, take the last one out. What have we got left? Three. In fact, I think um, because <sighs> because I've got this in the way, we might. Uh, well, mm, mm, I think we'll just bring it around. Let's bring it around. Uh, now, oh, I should show you this too. Here we go. A uh, bit of excitement here. We can make coarse dirt. The recipe for coarse dirt is uh, two dirt and two gravel. Um, now, let me, I'll just show you in the full crafting thing. Um, they have to be zigzag like this. If you do it the other way around, it won't work for you. And actually, does it have to be... Yeah, so there you go. So in that crisscross pattern, the X pattern there, um, and what you can do is get yourselves your coarse dirt, right? And lay it out like this. Oh my, please don't let something spawn on here. Uh, I'm going to need <laughs> a hoe. And then you can till this to make regular dirt and sometimes you do the double and that's okay uh, if you do the double it just uses more of your uh, more of your hoe and then you've got yourself more dirt simple as that it's a, it's a great little trick to know you're going to need the, that mob farm to do this of course because you need the gravel drops from the zombies and we don't have anyone in here yet what are you I don't know. I think you're just a skelly with fancy pants. Um, let's clear this out again. Oh, it's gonna be it's gonna be panic stations when we find one of these. But anyway, uh, it should be good. It should be good. So we've got ourselves some dirt. We've got ourselves a whole lot of stuff. My inventory is getting chockers, but that's all right. Nothing there. Okay, let's run this dirt out here. Uh, we're going to need torches. <gasps> yes, I've got torches, you beauty. Because you know what's going to happen, of course. I'm going to forget the torches and... <laughs> I'm crouching. Whew. Um, let's get up on there. Can we get up? Yes, we can. Okay, and we'll run this out here. And the plan now, of course, is to let the grass spread uh, all the way out here and we'll get ourselves a little platform at some point soon here we go nothing yet <sighs> now the reason I'm using I know you don't have to use a sword to do this um, but you do actually hit a few more mobs doing this these bats drive me crazy and as I understand they chew up the uh, the mob cap so here, here, it's worth clearing them out. Get out of it! Hello, little kiddo. Uh, no, that's a skelly. Alright, I say, give me a few minutes and I'm going to find ourselves the first of our zombie villages. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Hot potato, hot potato. Potato, potato, potato. Nope. Well, you know what happened. <clears throat> I was over there doing the thing, slashing away at everything that dropped. And a zombie villager dropped right in front of my nose. And I killed him! <sighs> this is... Oh, look at that. This is my life now. Uh, anyone? Oh, look at that. Yes, 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 
Yes. Kill. Maim. <laughs> well, this is pretty rare. We've actually got two witches come down at the moment. We don't have any redstone yet. Let's see if, uh, if this one gives us... Nah. This one? <laughs> Get out of it, bat. No, but we did get uh, we did get some glowstone dust, which would be great. Uh, but <clears throat> still, no zombie villager. <sighs> oh, we get another one. Let's try again. Good, good. die, die, witch, die. Ugh. What was that? Oh, glass bottle. No sugar. All right, well, that'll come in handy later on for uh, for making potions. Oh, my goodness. <sighs> Back to it again. Oh, quick. Right, smash the button. Oh, okay, we're recording. Now, this is, this, is, this is the tricky bit. This is the tricky bit. What I need to do is to try and isolate this guy up the end here. Uh, we need to get him... Sort of on his own. Ooh. Okay. Uh, uh, now, the problem will be that... Um... Oh, no. Duh! I hit him. Ah! No, don't hit him. Um... No, no, get out of there. Uh, oh, the, the... I'm getting things shooting at me because... That's what they do, they're jerks! When I squat, they do it. Okay. He's isolated. I think, I think, I think. Now don't shoot at me anymore. Although, I tell you what, if you do shoot, sometimes I pick up records. Okay. He's on his own. <clears throat> Are you ready? You ready for... Oh, let's put a little bit of a safety rail out here. Uh, we'll go bottom slabs. <sighs> Whew! Okay. Hello, buddy. Hello. Um, ah, so the thing I've brought, whew, forgot that, is a boat. We've got a boat. We've got a boat. Hey, buddy. And if we get him here under the edge, ah, whoo, whoo, whoo. he's not going to burn in the sunlight. Oh, okay, so the final trick is get everything back the way it was. Nothing blow up. Oh, listen to that. So the skeletons are shooting the, the creepers here, which is great. Ah! Oh, I don't like that. Oh, of course, they're all going to start dropping in now. Cut it out. Cut it out. And boop. Hey, hey! And look. <laughs> You stupid things. We've got us uh, some music discs because the uh, the skelly bobs are shooting the creepers whenever I uh, whenever I crouch. So crouching up here means um, uh, the mobs can see you. So whew, it's a little bit it's a little bit fraught. We've got ourselves number one. What a handsome looking fella you are. Oh, we're back. Okay, let's do it quickly. Let's do this one quickly. Let's do this one quickly. Come on up here, buddy. Come on. Come on, get up, get up one end. Come up here. No, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Oh, oh. Uh, no, we want to get rid of you. Up here, up here. Uh, eh. Just get him in. Okay. All right. Now we just need, we need things to. S oh, okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't need you. Don't need you. Don't need you. Boo. Oh, no. Uh. Eh, eh, okay. Do we get that? No, 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 no. Stop it. Stop it. Get over. Eh, eh. Uh, uh. Get. No, I don't want to use the sword. Because it will do the thing to the thing. All the mobs keep dropping. Uh. Well, uh, well, okay. So that's sort of a start. Ah. Uh. Okay, hitboxes. No, that's tooltips. Stop it. There it is. Okay, 
Right, get you out of the way. Uh, no! Get you out of the way. No, there's... Are there what? Oh, goodness me. Um, okay. Can I get this up there without touching him? Oh, is there a torch there? I think there's a torch there. Oh, this is... No. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? There's a torch there. Get out of it. No. Oh, now we've got one with... Stop. I'm going to have to move him across one, aren't I? All right, let's clear all this out. Ho! Oh, hitboxes. No. Stop it. Oh, I'm in spectator mode. Oh, this is a disaster. I shouldn't be allowed to do this. No, oh, I nearly fell out the bottom of the world. Hitboxes. Oh. Oh my goodness. Whew. Stop it. This is... <laughs> Let's pretend none of that happened, shall we? I've got to do this. Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm, in, I'm in strife. I'm in strife. We've got to clear all this out. We've got to put this here. We've got to put that there. Okay. F3... B. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. We need to... Hey, buddy. Can you get out of the way, please? I <laughs> know. Oh, that's a thing. Oh! I think we did it. Oh, at least... I've... Well, there's another one there, just in case. I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm calm. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's give out. Is that what I wanted to do? No, that's what I wanted to do. I want to give ourselves just this wall here for the minute. <sighs> okay, we've got a boat. I've got a thing. I'd like to just eat, just in case something goes pear shaped. Oh. <sighs> Here we go. Come on, buddy. You've got an arrow. That's good. That's good. Come on. Come on. Hello? Ah! Hello? Oh, you're quick. Why are you quick? <sighs> okay. 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 We're going to do this again. That. 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 I'm, I'm pretty chuffed, though. We've got our two villages. So, in case... I didn't explain it before, which I don't think I did. The idea with these lovely looking dudes and dudettes here is that we are going to get ourselves uh, some splash potions of weakness. I think I've said that right. I think I've said that right. And some golden apples. And we're going to heal these. And these are going to become... Uh, the first of our breeders to get us towards Piggy <laughs> to get us towards our iron farm. Hello, look at you, lovely thing. Oh, it's all happening. Look, ladies and gentlemen, that is it. I've got time for it today. Oh, I feel like we've achieved a few things in this episode. It's been another big episode, that time lapse. I love them. I love them. I love them. Next episode, let's start working with these uh, with these villagers and start working towards getting these healed. You know what we're going to need to do? We're going to need a gold farm in the nether. Here comes the beat! That's it for this week. Thank you so much. Leave a comment for me if you like what you're seeing. Hit that subscribe button if you'd like to see more. And I'll see you in the next episode.